Yo, what is good, my anime people? What is good, yo? Oh my god, it's blasted to that guy. Um, I... Oops, I guess I wasn't supposed to kill him. I have been looking forward to a couple of these shows lately, and after finally seeing them today, uh, it still feels really slow. I don't know why. It feels like this show is just really trying to paste itself out. Um, I would love to have a confirmation about like a part two or something or more to see but to see this whole entire episode kind of playing out as the apprentices and then you know now next week is them adventuring out or becoming adventurers it just feels like they know um that their pasting is very very slow and if that's the case it it almost seems like they're trying to slow it down so the source material can have more stuff or I don't know what else they could be doing it for, right? Like, I just want to know if there is a lot of, uh, like, content that they could be using. Are they going to use it at this pace? Or are they not going to get to it and just see how the show overall does at this pace so it's built up? Because, to be fair, I'm not mad that it's building up. I'm more so mad that it feels... Um, it feels relatively uh, just like it's explaining too much, you know, not not explaining too much, but it's going into the explanation as much as the actual <clears throat> action to getting to what they're talking about. So, for instance, the the best instance was like the fire, like it didn't take them long to get through all that, but. To then tell them, um, you know, about all the all the types of magicians and all that stuff, it all makes sense that that should be elaborated on because we have no actual understanding of the world and all that stuff. But then, you know, we see the we see the pixie or the the power that our main character, the guy, is going to achieve by. You know, it, it pretty much just floating around him saying, I want to meet you soon and this and that. So we have a good understanding that they have some bond already. It just hasn't been formed. And once that bond is formed, he can then wield the power to destroy nations and stuff like that. And that's where the story gets like really cool is they're trying to incorporate all of this like highly anticipated stuff already like, oh, if he becomes this, we will be in trouble. If if she does this, she will be, like, the most craziest thing ever. Um, in the case of, like, uh, magicians. Like, if she has all the the types that she can use, which that's what kind of seemed like a summoner was doing. But, no, a summoner is even more broken because they can control space and time. So, there was so much that they were telling us about that, it feels like we shouldn't be seeing it anytime soon. Um, in that part kind of makes me worried. Uh, I mean, they're talking about all that stuff, but yet our, P our, you know, our two apprentices are just now getting to their, you know, they're just making their strides. They're just getting better. But at the end of the day, no one has actually, you know, besides them fighting the same horse that pretty much made them run away in the first place, they haven't done anything like tremendously like, oh my god, that was hype, anything like that yet. And it's been two episodes. So that's, I can understand that frustration of the, of the people who are watching this looking for a new show to get into it like, this day and age, all anime has been relatively is uh, um, is just boom, 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 boom. Everybody dies. Everybody's fighting. Everybody's doing this. The story is like this big battle starts and then it goes back into, you know, and that's how this story started. It's just after all those big battle, like after the battle with the horse, it wasn't, there was nothing spectacular that happened. You know, there was some. There was barely any comedy. Like, if you call it comedy, then 
um, then yeah, that's that's on you. But I didn't I didn't really see too much actual comedy coming out of it to save the bland like storytelling bits of it. Like usually, if you want to, you know, take a world and build it up and stuff, you usually want to make that world and the the people inside of it interesting enough to have people just looking around not really worried about uh the overall narrative and be excited about everything not just the effect that this story is about someone who can practically wipe out a nation by himself so that that seems like more of the focal point this week's episode than anything it's like oh i am i should be practically the 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 Hokage of this whole world. Uh, no, but he should be, you know, the if if he really puts his mind to it, he will become one of the most dangerous people of all time. And that's what everybody's kind of worried about in the case of uh, his teachers and just the grand fact that someone like him exists in the first place. But that's when it gets weird, too, because the girl who then is teaching him all this stuff is not like worried of a man who just said oh i'm not here to you know take over nations and do this and that i just i just want to learn how to be strong so i can do whatever i want pretty much you know like he has this nonchalant relaxed like uh style about him and i think that is like she said it's really worrisome but yet she then continues to teach him all these stuff that then would you know continue to make her worry even more so it didn't really give us like she didn't show us a side that it's like oh i i like these kids but can i trust them or something like she could betray them or anything like that so i don't know there's a lot of things missing i feel like that could make this story uh uh, the, like the storytelling of this bits right now like more convincing and more compelling but I still feel like there's potential and this is only the second episode so to think that I'm I could even consider dropping the show is kind of messed up in my grand scheme of how I do reviews cuz there's some shows that I didn't like for you know like f- almost 5 episodes and I still give it a chance on the 6th one you know so to be a hypocrite and drop a show on the second one would be just not what I do on my channel so that being said i will see you guys tomorrow this was my last video i made for the day so feels good to play old games that still look amazing like for some reason this game looks so much better than one of the other ones i was already playing so i'm kind of happy i got back on this i'm trying to platinum all the games on my playstation 4 so i do truly apologize that there's some games in the background that you don't want to see uh and i'm waiting for new games to come out so as soon as new games come out and i have something to actually show in the background that's brand new i'll just do all my platinuming on my own time and i will be able to play new content very soon so with all that being said i hope you guys have an amazing day night evening whatever the case may be i am your boy the anime g and i will definitely talk to you tomorrow so with that peace